Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rebecca. So today we are gonna throw four 90s friends outfits. I obviously don't have all the outfits in my head, but what I think we're gonna do is go shopping, look for 90s pieces or pieces that I think we can incorporate into like outfits that I remember from the show. We'll go from there, but first I wanna talk about like my favorite outfits from kind of like season one, season three-ish. There's some cute outfits with like some mid-rise and high-rise jeans. I think Rachel also has some really beautiful mini skirt outfits and she also has a lot of beautiful dresses. All three of them actually have a lot of nice dresses so we're definitely going to the dress section some great coats some great sunglasses so let's go inside and see what we can find i'm starting off in the blankets and i found a vintage point blanket i think it's vintage at least the problem is the tag is gone but i love the green color They do wear a ton of jean overalls, so I would love to find a pair that like fits me well and that I like the wash, um, but I haven't found anything so far. I love this little tag and the wash of these, but they wouldn't fit me. I just think it's so interesting. Okay, I was about to go to the dresses, but I found this mink coat. It smells kind of funny though, and it's ripped everywhere, but it's a really good price. It has a bad smell. Maybe we'll get it. We're in the dresses now. We wear so many cute dresses in like the first three seasons, so let's take a look. Okay, so this is vintage, made in the US, and I think it's super cute, but I also think it would be super short on me. This is super 90s. It was made in Canada. Even though it really fits the theme, I just feel like I have so much like it. So I think this is really cute and I love the frills. It smells a little bit like weed though. I love this flowery, delicate, dainty, colorful one. I feel like it's maybe something Phoebe would wear. This just smells too bad. I have to get rid of it. I'm always hesitant to go through like the tanks of the t-shirts, but Rachel has so many cute t-shirts like the Frankie Say Relax one and the I Heart New York one. I didn't find any pretty vintage t-shirts in that section. Maybe we'll have more success in like the sleeveless tops. I love this linen cotton blend Banana Republic top with like the buttons. This color is so nice too. I love how dramatic this cardigan is. It's like sheer with red flowers. It's vintage. It is. It was made in the US, so it's very, very cute, but I can't get it. I'm looking through the sunglasses now, and there's so many cute like mini sunglasses at the thrift store that you can find. Like I found that Maui Jim pair a few months ago. Loved it. Let's see if we can find something again. I also don't see anything in the case, unfortunately. Another thing I noticed is Rachel is often wearing like beach cover-ups as skirts out and about, so let's go also to the scarves later to look for that. Look how cute this flowery beach cover-up is. I love it. The problem is it is a medium, but I think it's so cute. This was just sitting on the end here, and of course a polo crew neck is something Rachel would 100% wear, so maybe I will get it. We are checking out the skirts now. I love this jean skirt. It's simple, which I like. It's for sure handmade. I might get it. So I like this Ann Taylor skirt. I love the colors, um, but someone took it in and it's coming apart and I'm just not even sure what size it would be now. Oh my gosh, we're right beside it. There's a 100% silk Orizio skirt with pleats. How cute is this? Look at this amazing leather skirt. I feel like I can make it work. You also see Rachel wearing a ton of vests in like the first couple seasons. So I'm gonna check out the vests. I don't know if I'll find something that I really like myself though. This feels very 90s.
An honorable mention, this feels like something Janice would 100% wear. Now that it's a little less busy, in this section we're going to finish off the tops with the short sleeve mitts and some blouses. So here are the tops that I'm considering, this black lace one that's sheer and this striped one that's sheer and boxy. I don't know though. Moving on to the long sleeve blouses now. Um, it is summer, so I kind of don't really want to get anything too warm, but let's look for like cotton and linen and silk things. These are the blouses I found. This one is missing a button, but I like it. And this one is silk, but I'm wearing a black long sleeve silk. Okay, our last top place is the short sleeve blouses. This is very cute, but I have too much like it. Yeah, just looking for anything 90s, anything that reminds me of their outfits. One thing Rachel does wear frequently is like tie up tops that tie up at the stomach like this. If I run into one that I love, I might get it, but we'll see. So this one is supposed to be a tie up top, I believe, but I don't know. I don't think I would wear it that often. Okay, I'm gonna look at the intimates now for like pretty slinky black things and slip dresses. So I found this orange slip dress and it says it's 100% silk, but it doesn't really feel like silk. I don't know. I keep running into sections that I forget to go through, so we have to go through the normal dresses. But anyways, the first thing I found was this suede dress with like these gold beads everywhere. It feels very 90s. I don't know whether to get it or not. Do you see how interesting it is though? This dress slash jacket attachment thing reminds me so much of an outfit Rachel wore. Um, it also has little ties on the side. It is really cute, but I don't know. I don't think it would be very breathable. Like, I bet it's polyester. Okay, well, close enough. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna get it. Moving to the shoes now. I don't have very much luck in the shoes often. I still like to look, though. Those are kind of cute. <laughs> yeah. We are in one of my favorite sections now, the scarves. This is the worst way to describe your fabric. I hate that. It feels so tricky. This one has an interesting tag. It was made in Italy and it's made of three things and I have no idea what Floco is. But I don't think I'm gonna get it. It is time to make decisions. Okay, so we are back home now. I have everything right there. We're doing outfits from season one to season three, mostly season one and two. There's lots of Rachel, some Monica, some Phoebe, although I would love to have more Monica Phoebe outfits. So without further ado, let's get into the haul. I'm gonna start with a piece that I think is the most 90s-esque piece, and it is this plaid vest. Now, vests were huge in the 90s, especially in Friends. You see them all the time wearing vests, jean ones, plaid ones. They often wore them with black mini skirts and tights, and of course, high-heeled loafers. I do think it's cute. I think it maybe looks a tiny bit costumey too, but I also like it. It's very Christmassy, and maybe that's where I'm getting the costumey vibes. I got a lot of these photos from an article ranking Rachel's worst to best outfits in season one. I don't agree with a lot of their opinions, but from that I realized just how much Rachel wears vests, so I felt like this was the perfect piece, and if you want to emulate some friends outfits, particularly Rachel from like the early seasons, get a vest. Next up, I got this white slip dress. Now, I am 100% sure that this is 100% silk. <laughs> um, it doesn't say anywhere, but it feels like silk. I just know, I can tell now at this point. It's this cream color and it has two slits on the side. Now, it definitely feels like a 90. I styled it based off of this Rachel outfit from season two or season three, where she's wearing like white sneakers, lots of jewelry, and a cute little slip dress. I think it's really cute and simple. I also added a bag and some mini sunglasses at different points just to see what that would look like. I do think maybe belting this or adding some kind of layer would definitely help with making this look more like a daytime dress, which is my goal because this baby needs to be worn out. I love it. 
Next up, I got this leather skirt. Now, this is risque. There are these ties at the side and this big slit that is just right in line with the middle of my butt cheek. So I don't know, it might be a little too risque for me. I might list this one on the site if you're interested in it, let me know. Again, like I said, black mini skirts, they wear them all the time in Friends. So I decided to style this outfit off of a season three Rachel outfit where she's wearing this like white collared top and this over shirt with these big buttons and black loafers. Collars feel really 90s, so do the loafers, and I knew that we had to get a black skirt in this haul, and honestly, leather, I'm very happy about that. Moving on, I got a second silk piece, and it is this silk skirt. It's Aritzia, and it is 100% silk, which I love. It's black, it has these pleats on the front that kind of go down, and it's so flowy and beautiful and soft, and I love it. I had a couple ideas for styling. I saw Phoebe wear a, like a midi skirt with a long sweater. That didn't really work for this, so instead I paired it with this button-up jean shirt that cinches at the waist because, like I said, they wore so many jean vests and one of Rachel's was cinched at the waist, so I thought it was perfect and I wore it with these high-heeled boots. They also wear lots of high-heeled boots. Since I was trying to keep it with theme and be able to bring it back to an outfit in the show, I would love to style this outside of the show because I think it has a lot of potential. Moving on, I found another silk dress. This says it's 100% silk. It feels slightly different than silk, but I can still believe it. I also love this color. I didn't realize how good this color would look on me. I also had to wear a slip dress under it because it is way too sheer. I feel like for this one, I just don't think I can necessarily wear this one out. But the way I decided to style it for friends was wear like this collared tied up in the front top. They often wear tops tied in the front. Rachel, Phoebe. I think even Monica. And then I just wore some sandals with it. I feel like platform flip-flops would be the best and be like the best kind of 90s option. Didn't have any though, but anyways, we just went with what we had. Now, the final item is this sleeveless top. I love this color. This was actually my favorite color crayon when I was younger. I love the neckline and I love the buttons in the back. I think it has so many nice details to it. It's so flowy and comfortable. I wanted to pair this with a sarong because they wear so many sarongs in like the early seasons, particularly Rachel, and I actually really like that look, but I didn't have one that would match. So I had to go with trousers. Trousers are very 90s, especially big billowy ones like these with this chunky belt and these matching loafers. I also thought I could wear it with jeans because I've definitely seen Monica wear like red tank tops like this with jeans. That idea was very simple though, so it couldn't be my main one, but I really like the trousers look. I think it's really cute. And the sarong would have been cute too if I could have found one. So yeah, that was everything I got. Let me know how you think I did recreating all these friends outfits. I would love to do it again. And let me know what your favorite piece was down in the comments below and let me know what you've been thrifting for recently. And don't forget to check out my site, Blue of Genoa, for a new drop, finally. I'm so sorry, it's been so long. Anyways, if you like this video, leave a like. And if you wanna see more videos from me, subscribe. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and I'll see you next time, bye.